a few minutes ago, you were here with Faith Mutsoli on Strength of a Woman, on a beautiful lady who won in a beauty contest. And that is a real thing to do today because it's a strength of, it's a, a WCW uh, Ladies' Day. And uh, on Ladies' Day, it's good to discuss things that benefit the ladies. So today, we are going to discuss about uh, genuine love. The opposite of genuine love is fake love. So it's today's genuine love. My name is Ankara Kaesu, and I am not alone in the studio. As usual on Winners' Days, I am with beautiful ladies, uh, Liz and Glory. How are you girls? We're fine. You good. You, it's written all over your faces. <laughs> I don't know who brings me guests, but they are fond of choosing the best of the best ladies. Huh? You Thank have you. faces, you have everything that you <laughs> Ah, okay. Uh, I know you'll say you have names and contacts. People may follow you on social media. Msiwasumbue sana atisiji nini atisiji nini. Msiwasumbue watu by the way. I'll give you advice for free. <laughs> so you tell us about yourself, starting with you, Glory. Okay. Um. Good morning, guys. My name is Glory Kairi. I am an advocate trainee at the moment at the Kenya School of Law, and uh, generally I just love learning things on the internet so as long as i can learn anything then yeah i definitely will take my chance and my time to oh. invest in it your social media handles oh if you don't if you don't mind <laughs> uh, you can find me as a glory mwende on literally every platform oh yes. glory mwende yes awijaweka zile za madoido za that lady, butilicious. <laughs> no, no. I, um, my mind is not that, if I may say, creative. Be, because lawyers are strict or something. Uh, no, it never really even had to do with my co Your career. career yes. It was just something, you know, looking forward into the future. Would I really like to have that name? Yes. on my social media platform so i just decided to go with my usual names okay yes uh, somebody is telling me from the audience those who are watching mm -hmm. that you introduce yourself again you tell them your names again oh my name is glory kairi and i am an advocate trainee at the kenya school of law oh nice yes. glory kairi welcome to white Five. thank you so much yeah. for having me it's a yeah. pleasure to be here karibu akili thank you uh, next we have liz yeah by name i'm called liz akoth I just did my nursing and on social media, I'm not a good fan in that, but I go by name Liza Koth, L-I-E-T-Z, to be precise, not L-I-Z, so that are my social media handles. You know one thing f with you, both of you today, is that you're so real, real even with your names and... Uh, Nikiongelea mambo ya makeup faith ataniua nikirudi but but I'm I'm Java makeup mko too naturally beautiful I don't know Liz why you didn't choose to be fake because ama because we are talking about genuine things today. Yeah we are talking about love <laughs> we need to show ourselves so love the, has real, to be the real part of us. Yes. Mm. Oh, I like it. Welcome, Liz. Thank so you. So today, as yes, we talk about uh, genuine love, uh, can you start with you, Liz? Tell us what you think genuine love is. Uh, to me, Neza said, my genuine love is about action. You can't tell somebody, I love you, yet the action speaks vice versa. Uh, so for me, genuine love is what you do. What, is, what does your action speak about the genuine love? Uh, that will be my definition on genuine love. Okay, because you've defined it so well, so Glory will tell us what you think fake love is. Because I think the genuine love, its opposite is fake love. Mm -hmm. So what do you think fake love is? Um, so for me, I would say that fake love is a love that just keeps on taking and never gives. Yes. So because of that, then if you ever see signs of that, then you can be sure that that is definitely fake love. Oh. Yes. Uh, how, how long can it take you to identify a fake love from a genuine one? Um, you know, there are some people who are very good at hiding. So you can take picture white and they won't... Uh, they won't, you won't know their intentions from the very beginning. Yeah. But it will definitely show itself like there are things that you can't hide for long. Yes. Yeah, so that I believe say, fake love, you know it when you see it. But must it take so long to know fake love, Liz? Because, uh. you know, uh, because this now it will seem like girls are gullible. Mm -hmm. Like you can be cheated for maybe three months, somebody gets what she wants and move away. So why can't you just spot it on the same day you meet your first <laughs> day to say, I think I can spot fake love at 
the first time. He doesn't have to talk me decades yeah. for me to identify fake love. So, utawana mtu, how somebody talks. Bile mtu anaongea speaks a lot about who you are. Bile ameji present, speaks a lot of what somebody is. Mm. Akionge utajua the intention. Umtu wako na intentions gani. So, from there, we'll identify this is fake. Oh. This person is just after something. So, it's not a real love. So, ubaya, labda utaidentify kama some things have happened. Like, mm -hmm. maybe ukona ball. Uh -huh. Eh? Hey. Already, alafu na ona ujama kwa na nipenda ukweli. Uh, can't we know? Okay, thank. Let's uh, let's take this with glory. Mm -hmm. Can't you know my pema enough before you delve in other things that people with real love do? Mm -hmm. Can't you identify to my pema alafu avoid to ujama my pema if you can? I think you can, yeah. but you know decision na kuanga yako. Kujua kama you'll walk away or you'll stick around. Uh -huh. You see. So, but kuna, you know, in this generation, people are wamekua so good at hiding. Uh -huh. uh, yes. They are very, uh, they are fake love, so to speak. So, you see, it's, it's still a bit hard for people to detect. So, uh -huh. you might, you might not. So, it depends on the circumstances and the person you're meeting. Yes. Yes. I, I, I was studying about some some basics of uh, of real love mm -hmm. and the one which was coming on top was respect mm -hmm. you can know when one is not respecting you and yeah. when it's respecting you mm -hmm. like uh, the things that if somebody tells you or does to you you just rightly know that this person doesn't respect you because love comes with respect come on to a respect akupendi sivyo eh mtu akikufanyia nini utajua ako respect he doesn't respect you this mm -hmm. akikwambia nini ama akikufanyia nini utajua huyu jamaa mm -hmm. doesn't respect me mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, talking about respect uh, respect to taona because the way somebody talks to you will mm -hmm. tell you about more about this person so the more unaendelea kuongea na mtu if kama kuna respect atakuwa like throwing words and is not sorry unaje wala watu wanaongea mbaya na i don't care anaongea mm. mbaya but it doesn't care so i think apo utakuja kwa like this person had done me wrong but he's not even willing to say i'm sorry mm. so apo unapata there's no respect mm. kabisa una anaweza kufanyia tu kitu ama kuambia tu kitu alafu na he is not sorry about it eh, ako tu ni sawa so uh, utakanifanye yani mtu vile mtu anaongea like ai hapana but kuna tu vile mtu anaweza act unajua wanaume kwetu kusema sorry sio rahisi sana so kuna vile tu mtu anaweza to act one wenyewe is sorry kama kujangi na chicken home afanye uh, kitu alafu hiyo siku akwambie baby nimekuletea <laughs> usiku hiyo mtu aku make conclusions unaona <laughs> 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 nafanyiwa na sema hiyo mtu anadipenda afanye hizo ujui intention zake so utakonga like amenibaia kuku unajui labda kuna kitu anafanya na jaribu kuku please so uh, siku mtu aku make conclusions uh, wewe ngoja akwambie labda ta mean sorry labda ta ni present amekuletea tu uh, by the way uh, and you feel like he's sorry hapana but si nipoa tu muulize do you mean you're apologizing with this no, ama yeah. Yeah, same you can speak oh. out. Ni mnataka tu muambie I'm sorry baby. <laughs> yes, you can say sorry. Yes. yes. Eh, but, but ni ngumu <laughs> kwetu. Eh, kuna somebody from Busia called Dan. Mm -hmm. uh, kusema sorry ataona kama yeye yeah, ako na umama or something. But surely see that is the whole point. If you love someone, you'd be willing yeah. to do anything to keep them around and to let them know that I want you to I want us to do this together. Sindio. Including mm -hmm. umama. <laughs> so, so, how is it to mama apologizing for me saying sorry? Ai eh. Sema tu I'm sorry. Can <laughs> ah. But what do you have about respect? Ah uh, for me I would say respect is in the daily actions yes. of uh, the daily actions in the relationship even in the friendship because it's not just about a romantic it's also about platonic love. So you have to of course it, it's the daily actions that you take uh in terms of expressing how you love the person if you make a mistake own up to it sema yes. pole and then nisiku ile pole you just want to move past it you actually have to live through the sorry mm -hmm. no. it's not just about saying the words and then you leave it at that you have exactly. to act like it so if you make a mistake own up to it and change how many stories can you take <laughs> How many stories? As can many you as possible as oh. long as you own up to the mistake and you actually change for the better haina shida 
Mm. Leo mm. nikute na mtu kando ya barabara nikikatia mm. niseme sorry. <laughs> Kesho upate <laughs> mtu ni call saa sita ya usiku niseme sorry. Mm -hmm. uh, the next day upate nimetumiwa message nyingine romantic <laughs> niseme <laughs> sorry. Eh? Yeah? Okay, How many? How many? <laughs> you say you can take as, as many, many as you can. Uh, if you are willing to change. But then now, you see up all this as very, very uh, clear sequence that you're not willing to change. Mm -hmm. mm. You see, so mm. Apple, there's only so much a human being can take and they'll definitely up and leave. So Apple says, hello, mom, to Akienda. Luz, the second point was mm. about uh, patience and rudeness. Mtu anaiza kuwa too rude kwa ko. Hey, you know what somebody rude can do? Can slap you, mm -hmm. can insult you, can insult your parents, mm -hmm. can insult or everybody just before you. You can decide to be silent and all that. Yeah. Yeah. This shows that this person doesn't genuinely love you. I'm a love in a chayake too. Ah, people are different, but I think when it comes to love, it's all about communication. Atusha kuwa na wewe kwa nyumba, we don't communicate, atunasema it's your nature. I'm there as your companion, I'm there to talk to you, I'm there to listen to you. So ukinyamaza mita inaonesha another part of you. Wanasemanga people have to picture, kuna kuanga na photocopy na original copy. Kuna nyo anatembea na photocopies zao, yeah. na kuna nyo original copy. So for me, I'll see like, ukiwa kwa nyumba, if you've chosen me as your friend, you have to talk to me. You have to make me your friend. Ukinyamaza, I'll take that as being rude. Because mm. you have to speak it out. What is the problem? Mm. Ukinyamaza, I'll take it in another way. Yeah, but now sasa kama rudeness tu ya kukua mtu ni mrudu kwa ko. Mm -hmm. uh, mtu wa kugonge, Liz. Hii ngozi yako nyorona mm -hmm. mzuri. Hey, mtu wa uh, ngukie tu na slap. Mm -hmm. hey. Hey, Unajua sasa shida yenu madem, uh -huh. unawana lazima ugongwe ndiyo upendwe. <laughs> My co-presenter Faith told me where she comes from, uh -huh. ukigongwa ndi unapendwa. Tuisipo gongwa, uh -huh. yuna unyasha upendwi and all that. I don't know if that still happens in this generation where in kugongwa ndiyo umegongwa kiwa mdogo. Umegongwa kigongwa, teno kujo ugongwa in a relationship. Come on, it doesn't happen that way. Um, nimegongo ya kutosha, sija kujo ni gonge. Seki fika mali, sasa una, you are raising finger on me, being disrespectful. So I buy that. Kifika mali, una ni gonga, ay, hachatu iishe. Si lazima. I, I know where you come from. Mm -hmm. And somebody tells me, an um, audience, mm -hmm. that in a uh, lingana una gongo na nini. <laughs> 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 Kama una gongo na kia masibis. Iyo ni romantic. Kama una Pesa. gongo na bunda la manoti. <laughs> You're romantic. You too, you had to Glory, I kugongwa. Kuna madem wanasema ati ni normal too. Ati ni normal kugongwa. Ati ni normal. Where you as a lawyer, I would talk laws now here. Justice. Talk laws. Eh, talk justice now here. Well, uh, it's not just about that. Because you know the law is all about... Um, mm -hmm. re okay realizing whatever should happen in society. Mm -hmm. yes. Whatever the law is, should also happen in the society ideally. Okay, the society should, you know, drive the law and the law should move with the society. Yes. Uh. But then now, uh, uh, in terms of uh, such, that is uh, violence, domestic violence. Yes. So, you were physical, you were psychological, you were verbal. So, psychological is more manipulation. Yes. As, and it combines uh, a lot with, uh, with verbal. Uh, yes. abuse yes so if you ever detect that kind of uh, that kind of abuse in any way it is better for you to run mm. and don't look back run for your life run for your life yeah because, because anything can happen yeah and unfortunately what most people do not know this is not in the law but unfortunately what most people do not know is they they keep the they keep the trauma and they carry the trauma with them mm -hmm. and it permeates into so many aspects of their lives so najikuta uh, the verbal abuse you suffered a couple of years ago still yeah. affects the way you're living your life 10 okay. years later. Mm. And unfortunately, so many people don't realize, like a lot of our peop uh, a lot of Kenyans out here are walking around with so much trauma na hawajui, and in whichever relationship they're getting into, it always shows. It definitely manifests and it goes to hell. And so instead of now, you're, not only are you hurt, but you've hurt your partner and your partner has hurt you 
and it's a never ending cycle. So it's there. Yes. It's like yes. permanently there something. Yeah, and for if you work through it, it, you know for healing it's a long life journey. So till you breathe your last you're always healing. So mm. the best thing for people to learn is deal with your trauma mm -hmm. uh, and then now once you because of course you can't like say uh, let me deal with my trauma then I'll go get friends and have romantic relationships and whatever but uh, even as you're in those relationships be they friendships or romantic then you can definitely work things through recognize where your triggers are and where your trauma lies and then now from there you can definitely move ahead with your life and love people the way they're supposed to be loved I wish mm -hmm. all girls were thinking like you do. Mm -hmm. But unfortunately, majority of you, mm -hmm. uh, I don't know, maybe at a way, uh, mm -hmm. you <laughs> It's true, it does happen. Because, yeah. because yeah. you know, there is a kid who has a kid who has a baby. Kid, oh, <laughs> baby. Yeah. Yeah. Especially when it's a man from where I come from. I'm going to say, I told you. Yeah. <laughs> you don't see the rudeness in Yeah, him. it's true. Actually, just to give a, a little experience of where I work, I was in ear clinic and a woman just, just, just a lady, Ali Kuja, and Ali Kwa Mumwa Maskio, actually. Mumwa. A Mumwa. This man, like, you can see the part of the teeth, Kwa Maskio, even. So the doctor alikuwa namuuliza the person who deals with the ear clinic akamuuliza what happened yes. and alikuwa like mzee wangu amenuuma eh eh yani aliangalia tu mali pa kuuma kaona achukue masikio like ukuona sikia i don't know what always happened <laughs> but rapata mtu the lady anatibiwa but still goes back to the eh. home ameuma masikio the following day atakuja muumwa place nyingine who knows where but i think people are just different do you what Sijuni kutoka soma ama inaitwa the same ladies love too much yes. but hata kama hiyo ni love acha ikai cuz inafika extend unaumwa masikio yes Uju, what will happen next to you uh, u, on our social media handles mm -hmm. we have posted a, a, a question and mm -hmm. we need your reaction to mm -hmm. it because i want you to be part of this conversation not mm -hmm. only glory mm -hmm. and Liz. so in our social media platform especially on facebook kuna iswali tumeuliza mm -hmm. ni nini mtu akikufanyia utajua anakupenda cha ukwelo mm -hmm. i love our social media people <laughs> ukwelo ukwelo ni <laughs> <laughs> so ni nini mtu akikufanyia utajua anakupenda cha ukwelo so what you do mm -hmm. go to facebook just using your account then search white for for we are the only white five four in the world. So kifika hapo, utaona yu kushu unapo conspicuous, comment hapo. At the end of it all, tutakuja hapa na faith kusoma everything. Kusoma everything yanyo mwandika. So your moment of fame is glaring. Just some minutes away, about 20 or 15 minutes away, you'll have the, the moment of fame. Back to you girls. Mm -hmm. uh, somebody was talking about competition. Like umependana na mtu but mna compete nani anagada more wealth nani amesoma kuliko mwingine and somebody was saying that is fake love that if you really genuinely love somebody then you have to be supporting each other not uh, competing each other you attack we start with you glory okay so uh, what i would say about that is and for if that is the case in whichever relationship yes. that is unfortunate yes if you're competing you know it seems like kwani kwani are you billionaires competing on the forbes list for, to know who exactly will be the richest in the world if that is the case in the relationship then I, d I think that is more of a competition than it is of a relationship so because you're supposed to essentially complement each other not supplement so to speak yes so if you, you of course support each other if the other person uh, is better than you at something, accept it. You won't always be the best at something in mm. the world, you know. Uh -huh. So accept it, uh, learn to work with it, and whoever is being supported should also learn to be humble. Don't get so egotistical and be like, I'm better at this than you, I provide mm. this, I do this, I do that, and then, you know, of course that will make the other person feel like they are invaluable and invisible. So because of that, then the relationship might, might tumble and crash and all of that. So best thing to really think through things and then after that then i'm pretty sure the relationship will seal through Lisa a case mm -hmm. where somebody married somebody mm -hmm. and immediately ordered her mm -hmm. to stop going to job achana na hiyo job eh ko hapa ndakulisha because ukiwa umesoma uko na pesa utanidharau ama wengine wanasema you drop out of school achana na hiyo masomo it won't help you i'm here for you 
and that uh, I think the real motive of this guy mm -hmm. is that tu lazima kuichini ni aniti Tell me what you think about this. Afo Sandro, siju tutasema disrespect. Come on, your parents have struggled with you. Wame kufundisha mbako kafika. Alafu mwanahume anakuambia ti ukwe housewife. Who does that? <laughs> so, according to Minto, nda kama tumesema tunafua kusapotiana. Yes. I like umesema marriage. Yes. You know when it comes to marriage, something different from a relationship. Yes. Because hapa you now have a home. You have to build this home per moja. Yes. So when you tell me, you want me to be a house help. Yes. Will you able to maintain me? Unajua ni mesoma. Ndataka pesa ya kutengeneza nyuele. Pesa ya salon. Pesa vitu kama hizo. Saa uneza pata hiyo. Ile ya kikiisha. What will we do? I'm a house help. Mi sezi saidia. Akiwa menda mahali. Aja show up. Atuta ukula sasa juu. Mze labda yu. Kama akutuma pesa. No, I would buy the idea. Sezi kubali hiyo kabisa kukua house help na umesoma. Basi le fi yako wazazi wako wange mnunua na ongombe. So according to you, you think if somebody does that to you, then it's not in love? Yeah, it's it's not fair. It's fair. Kundo sasa we need girl child. Kwa unge asa idiwe. Serikali. You take baby girl? On that, what I would say is this. If a man, okay, what I usually believe in life, if... Uh, for you to stand, someone else has to kneel, mm -hmm. then that is definitely a very huge red flag. Yes. So, yes, that is a very huge red flag. So, okay, uh, if you have to be very careful with whatever it is you are expecting of the lady. Mm -hmm. So, you know, uh, even as women, we'll still uh, suffer in the workplace when, it, when we become mothers. So, of course, our jobs might backtrack and all of that because you have other responsibilities, not just your job now. You have mm -hmm. a home to take care of. But then uh, requiring someone to completely withdraw from something they love and a passion, I don't think you, ha you have to ask someone to sacrifice yeah. that. And you're, you feel, if I may say, secure in yourself. Mm. Then for me, that, I, th that, is, that, is, that is a huge no go zone. It's, yeah, it's no a go zone. no, no. No for you. No. I wish we had all the time to discuss that, but we have a lot <laughs> to discuss, so mm -hmm. let us move on. Yes. Mm -hmm. Insensitivity, insensitivity to feelings. Kuna mwenye unalia, Alafu anakuambia wewe Lea hapo ukimaliza ukuje unipikie. Lea, Lea Lea tu vile unataka. Hapa nikuleta Soviet. Hapa nikupaie tissue. Hapa nikufanyie nini? The person who is not sensitive to your feeling. Let's start with you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If someone is insensitive, no. Because now these are this is a relationship. Mm -hmm. These two of us, of course, uh, we won't agree on everything. Yes. You will hurt me. Yes. I, I most likely will hurt you. Mm -hmm. But then now, if you're not sensitive to whatever it is I'm telling you, then how to teach you more judge? Uh -huh. No, mm -hmm. no. Yeah. So if you're insensitive to my feelings, then what are two ikai? Hakuna jakushinda apa to keep up because we'll always be fighting yeah. and quarrelling, yes. and it's just. It's to, it's a very toxic environment to be in. So watch it, we can. But you know, you should need to de identify this early enough. I don't know yeah, what you can do to know that this guy is not sensitive to my feelings. And you know, as as uh, Glory says, it's a red flag mm -hmm. to to fake love. Eh? Mm -hmm. uh, Nafako identify my parents. Ju kama mtu akifanya nini, ju wata hide hide the initial yeah. time of relationship. Manga. But yeah. kuna kuna tu mtu wanafanya. Unaona uja ma is not sensitive to my feelings. Sivyo? Mm -hmm. uh, so, ukanyage kubwa kubwa vile uwa wanasema. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Ama uko mkoko hoteli, alafu you don't want to eat something na nasema. Hey, kula hiyo buwana. Hey, hiyo ndiyo naweza afon. <laughs> and by the way, sometimes it will end up like that. It always happens. Mtu wana kupeleka mahali and like, nacha na kuchagulia kinyo utakula. Mm. Kibandaski. <laughs> Aba what and I'm chagulia. I mean, don't I live? I mean, I'm chagulia. What you eat? But no, like, come on. That is not Felix. Now, here they, here they will laugh. He, kula kote ntumfuko ya we jama. Kama mama wa kuku spoil, aku spoil. But nimtu real, nimtu arka kuambi ame online can afford today is omena. So please, acha na na mbaza pizza and all that. La frase mami na crave ya pizza and all that. No. I only have a manner for yeah, you that's today. You're mm. poor. That's okay. Only jam a genuine. But your name is Tinji. You don't let her call Tinji. You don't let her call Tinji. big restaurant and I'm going to call Tinji. Hey. Hey, who'd not buy that? Okay. 
let's go on how he relates to your people, mm -hmm. to your uh, mother, to your sisters, and all that. Mm -hmm. Him too. Uh, na kwa mbea sitaki kuona watu wako kuja hapa. Mani nini unangia na mamako kwa simu <laughs> kwa, for, for 30 minutes and all that. Mm -hmm. uh, somebody saying that is real love. That somebody who loves you should love your people too. What do you think? One thing I'll say blood is thicker than, no, ndasema blood is thicker than water. Yes. We are not even related to you. Mini mekupata huko, umenipata huko. Alafu na nikataza my parents unye tukwa na odamu moja hivi. <laughs> hey, ya <yeah>, aje. <laughs> Unajua when you meet a guy, au mjuani, hata kuna kitiote ina, inaweka pa moja. But the bond you have with your parents, ni kitu ingine so strong. You've grown up knowing your parents. You've go, me grown up, hawa zazu wame kunacha. Uyo kijana wame kupata kama you are who you are. Yes. Your time. Yeah. Sasa na kustop from people who have nurtured you. By the way, there are people who cut way. you off from, even mm. your friends he you found you with. Mm. So yeah. from day, mstaki mm, kuona ukitambia na kina beril. Mm. Au ni wasichana wabaya. And uh, unadhani tu ni hiyo beril na hiyo rende so unachacha kidogo. Mm -hmm. And then he complains about your long phone calls to your sister and all that. So mm -hmm. anaku cut away from other people. Siju kamba hii namanisha ako jealous with those people. Anaku penda sana mm -hmm. adi yataki wengine wachukua attention yako or something. Uh, for me, if you if I see such a sign, we are, you just know the person is a narcissist. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, not okay. Let me not say narcissist. Uh, is displaying narcissistic behaviors. Yes. And so they are just trying to close you in a box where they can control you and manipulate you uh, and have you all to themselves. Yes. Um, I, I don't know if I can reference a, a movie yes, I yes, watched. Yes. Um, like Surviving R. Kelly. For some of the ladies there, you'd listen. Um, sh he would literally seclude them from everyone they know from yes. their families to and you know once if you don't have family support if you mm, don't have yeah. uh, friends uh, your friends around you can things can go downhill very quickly yes so because of that maintain your interactions with the people you love if mm. they can't agree if what i should clash the best thing is be civil around each other you don't have to be friends and completely love each other just find a balance Onge, uh, if kama ni kusalimiana salimiana ni too and then you go your different ways Mm. Yeah, if they won't agree, if the families won't agree, th that is your husband or your boyfriend and uh, as well as your family and your friends, just agree on an amicable way to live and then from there it's okay. You and speaking of family, mm -hmm. he doesn't want you to know his people. <laughs> yeah, uh, kupeleki nyumbani, akufanyi intro, hata marelo wake wenye wako wapa Nairobi, no intro, ye yeah, anataka tu, simitu yo tunapenda. <laughs> Mambo na bradangu na sistangu na maparensu wangu, achana nayo, achana nayo, achana nayo, achana nayo, achana nayo, ataki kukuintroduce anywhere. No, no, that is wrong, because lazima ni joko ni umetoka. Lazima ni, I must understand your value systems, I must understand mm -hmm. the ecosystem you grew, you grew up in, how you were nurtured, the nature around you. Uh, because now if I don't know that, then how will I, I'll, I'll, I can only see what you show me so uh, far, uh, but I can learn more from the people that you've surrounded yourself mm -hmm. with. Yeah. Okay. You know, how they say, show me your friends and I'll, uh, I'll show you your future, things like that. It's the same thing even when it comes to family. So get, let, me, let me get to know everyone around you. Mm -hmm. it's, it should everyone? Just every, okay, as many people as possible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not everyone, it's impossible for me to know everyone, but Liz, yes. Mtu anazasema, ataki ujuane na hawa tuwa kwa kusababu ni wabaya. Wengine ni witches. Hatu watakuroga, hatu watakuroga chana na usiende kwa, usiende, nisikupeleki nyumbani, we umeundua vizuri utarogo huko huo. Ama kuna kasini yangu mbaya ata kunyemelea mitu kama hizo. Kwe tuna hivu wati sasa na kuprotect. Hey, kwa nini mungu protection gani ya nalipea? Ok, kwa hiyo mtuwa kiniambia hivu, ala siyo nika tutafika kesho. Liba ah. uh, kesho atufiki. Kwa za already that is a red flag actually. Mtuwa kikuambia, I could introduce to nobody. Yu ni kumanisha ni kamo huo umefichwa. Hey. Unasikia nga hiyo married at night mchana ujulikani. Hey. Yu ni kama mtuwa meukuficha. Somebody who truly loves you will introduce you to his friends, his hey. family. Hey. So that in case ataki tu meukufanyikia, neza communicate with somebody else. I can communicate with your mom. Yes. I can communicate with the other part of the person I know about you. Yes. But ukini feature it will be like, hakuna vile neza ukusaidia. <laughs> Uh, yeah, and I feel too me feature. When it come a magendo. Yeah. Uh, when it come a... 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 When
Lafil kuna mtu mwingine basi anaonyeshwa. Uh, yeah. Niwe labda unafichwa so uoni uoni status and all that. Amekubana. Uh, <laughs> yeah if I can add to that. Yes. Um, I mean naelewa kuna balance ya you want something to be a secret mm -hmm. uh. and you want something to be private. Yes. Uh. You can definitely find if someone is keeping you as a secret then that is definitely a problem. Mm -hmm. But if the person just wants to be private, private. it's understandable. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, you, there are some people who don't even go advertising their whole relationship mm -hmm. to their friends. Mm -hmm. There are some people who we have no idea who their boyfriends are, but we do know they're in relationships, yes. you know. Yes. So it's if you want to keep it private that's okay. That is yeah. definitely understandable. Who does ataka keep you private? Yeah, like I don't well. personally that's that's my preference. I'd oh, much rather it be private yeah. rather than Usi don't keep me as a secret. Mm -hmm. so, yeah, a fatherly two silly yeah. posts. Let it just be between the both of us. Mm. I think a lot of people were very excited when a famous actress, Isare, yeah. out of the blue, to Nashtuki to Instagram and post her Rusia, were like, Hiya, you were dating yeah. actually. <laughs> so you see, that she kept better. it private, but yeah. it wasn't really a secret. Yeah. So I it's about. Um, it means exactly? you are, there's, prob there's a difference between privacy and secrecy. Yes, mm. yes, yes. Uh, there are, even um, a lot of uh, celebrities in Kenya right now, they keep their family secret, uh, not secret, sorry, private. Uh, they keep uh, their children, their wives, their husbands private. Yes. You definitely know they're married, mm -hmm. whether they're wearing a ring or not. Yes. But it's important for you to learn that it's not really a secret, essentially. Mm -hmm. But I think that's good because if somebody maybe th something happens to you, something negative, mm -hmm. it's upon you, it don't hit back up to your... Uh, up to your uh, relatives. Mm. Uh, you hear the story of Samido and her former, are they still married with Samido? Oh, you don't oh. know the oh, local yes, I do celebrities? Know him. I do know him. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 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 sorry, <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there's a lot of war between him and the wives. Mm -hmm. Jewish. Adi Sasa vitu nasties in a talker. So if maybe she kept this lady mm -hmm. in privacy, vitu avinge backlash, we love him backlash. But that is a story for another mm -hmm. day. Kunawa wa very small disagreement. Mm -hmm. Very small. Ameaza kusema, hii sasa hata kama tukiachana misi univaya. Like, anadangu liyo kuachana. Mm -hmm. eh? Anadangu mm -hmm. le, hiyo. Come on, nobody's eh, perfect. Na unatula abda umeaza kujua na na watu. <laughs> mm -hmm. Na sasa hata ukiniacha, sina shida. God knows will give me another one. Is that also a red flag that you, the love is not genuine? Yes, but, you know, sasa shida ni, uh, okay, if someone keeps dangling yo ya anataka kwa, I think hapo yo nafako inakuambia that the person is already set to leave, anangoja tu, mm -hmm. it's a matter of time, it's yeah. not a matter of if, it's when it's going to happen. Mm -hmm. yes. So you see now that's the other problem, that's yes. the issue. Uh, you know, the best thing in Akwanga, if you see someone doing, your partner doing something you don't like, mm -hmm. yes. of course, it, the best thing is to say, okay, so you have done this, I feel this way. Uh. Unona, explain it. Don't just, usi, usi, don't just, because otherwise you, you'll be a ticking time bomb. Mm. Takuwa just a matter of time, nilini, tutakuja, and then we, uh, something happens and then out of the blue the relationship is over. And you see, and it will leave a lot of heart behind. So the best thing is, if it's an insecurity or a fear, communicate it. And then we learn how to mm -hmm. work through it, you see. Yes. Yeah, couples therapy is there. Marriage therapy, I think, or uh, yeah, all of uh, those things. Just go for therapy and get all the, these things addressed because it's trauma. Just trauma underneath that's uh -huh. uh, trying to come to the surface. Please, in Azakuja, in another package, mm -hmm. Mkotu story vizuri, uh -huh. kama wenye wana pendana, yes. alafu wana leta story ya, uh hivi -huh. tukeachana, uh -huh. utaenda kuambia watu, let's see, tukeachana. Yesha kuacha. Tukeachana. Ah, this story too, you are not fighting. This story too, alafu, so hiyo inatokea tu. Hivi tukiachana, unasa date my best friend tukiachana, kuje tu hivu. Hiyo pia ni red flag. According to hiyo, wakinuliza hivu, kwane ataka kuniacha, mine zamuliza, untaka kuniacha. And maybe if the friend is better, why not? Unesa, unesa pichana, eh. Hiyo ni rude. Hiyo ni rude ukiambia mwana uwe. Ok, lakini unajua wako somebody ya kulize, tukiachana. Labda kuna antaka kukuacha, ama na feel there's something you're not doing it right. And it feels like I have to want to walk out. Unelewa? So ikifika pale mtu juu I think when I say manga you accept it with my imperfection yes. na ku accept the imperfection we make it perfect because yes. the imperfection can be my perfection yes. so no na sasa tunasaidiana so maybe i've done something wrong ujaniambia and you feel like tukiachana 
Unajua mtu kifika mbali anasema tu anaanza to think about nyinyi kuachana. Kumaanisha there's something that is not going right. Mm. So akaanza kuniambia hivyo and I'm like una plan kuniacha mama plan to achane. What is the problem? Let that take us to the mm -hmm. argument thing. Mm -hmm. Kama in every small difference mm. mna argue kitu kidogo tu inawakosanisha mnaanza ku argue mm. kidogo tu mnaanza yani hata sema mnatembea tao alafu by accident ugongane na mtu sema mm, nilijua tu jamaa kuna vile eh, ama uangali we unatembea tu uangali nyuma tu ana ku treat hivyo like your communication is not smooth mnaanza mm -hmm. kidogo tu mmeanza ku kuenda off like hizi mm -hmm. maliza day kabla mgongana in communication mm -hmm. uh, is that genuine love to I you see genuine kwanza yeye ni disrespectful yeye ni being rude and other names you can bring in because i feel like tawana tawana you can bump into somebody by mistake or anything like that can happen if umefanya kitu ndogo ama sijui kama kuna vitu ndogo na vitu kubwa cuz mimi nasema nasema ngadambi dhambi ni dhambi so i think if i've done something wrong uh -huh. it's you niambie liz this and this is what you've done yes ukireka sirika hata mimi najua kukasirika Uh, Pia muta fanya tu hivyo na atakasirika. So the best way ni you guys mukae mu handle your things right. Tell me this and this is what you've done and it's not right. I'll tell you this and this is what I've done and it's not right. We come together to make correct. Uh, It won't repeat itself. Vile tu tulisema we were talking about kusamehana. Yes, yes this amia mtu 100 times. Uh, but wanasema anga kosa si kosa, kurudia kosa ndio kosa. Yes. If somebody has wronged you once, utamwambia uh, akwambie sorry, it's okay. Akirudia you'll be like hapana, sasa hii ni mazoea. Eh, hey, no, unasema yeah, ni too anasema, much. Anasema tu it's too much. So I feel like communication is very kama kuna something that is very key when it comes to relationship, yes. it's communication. How do you communicate to your partner? with in terms of crisis in terms of depression in terms of anything that comes in within unaongea uh, aje so it's a communication very key okay yeah, yeah i think uh, that is a, a heavy point mm -hmm. but let's come to uh, things body mm -hmm. it is very hard to differentiate between love and, infatu and infatuation mm -hmm. if very somebody is really loves you and if somebody just want you for leisure mm -hmm. and all that I don't know how you come to know starting with you Gloria mm -hmm. that this person is just interested in having me uh having my flesh and all that. I don't know how you know that this person genuinely loves me or this person love me for want me for other things. Uh I think you'll have to look at what exactly they want to pursue when it comes to you. So Uh, I think there's a way you can tell that this person is borderline obsessed yes. with me or whatever it is I can offer. Yes. And then when other things come because no human is perfect mm. and then when my because of course you'll meet the person and then utavutwa na mambo mazuri then when the other uh, when now I start showing you more of me yes. then you start retracting yes. uh, I think that is when you can definitely pinpoint that this is This person does not love me for who I am, just yes. for what I can offer and what I have. Yes. And so because of that it would be best if I just mm -hmm. yeah. I would so really be you a man or a woman, it that is definitely a sign and a pointer for you. In yes. terms of all of that, in terms of knowing if the person is obsessed with you or if the person actually loves you. Elise, what do you think about? Uh, it will take time. Unajua wa uh, kuna tactics uh -huh. i don't know si jua nasema nga women are powerful but me say ni zasema men because uh -huh. a guy will come to you wanasema ni ile photocopy obvious i want to tell you the bad part of me ndakwambia oh i'm good i'll treat you nice and you'll be like as ladies tunaongea utaenda kwa mabeshe zako mbe ule cha liability treat poor uh -huh. amenifanyia hivi na hivi so you don't see the intention unaona tu na the good part uh -huh. say na kwa bit hard for you to realize what is this guy after because mm. i make treat poor and you're like acha tu nipatie huyu chali chance mm. unaelewa but you just sometimes it's not too late when you come to realize this guy was after something because mm. after when you want something you go for it if you want to be a nurse you want to be a lawyer una work hard for it yes. so when that guy wants that lady ata do anything men will do anything wewe utajuaje so it, huyu jamaa anataka tu itakuwa hard but i think from me from me as a jua through conversation ama temu mvisit moves zenyana make can you 
aongea uh, about something sensitive ama he doesn't have time for you guys to talk yeye kitu anashughulika tu ni kushika and is eh. it, mind yako una tu eh hey, so seme tu kitu unataka eh si si labda atasema utadu but unajua when it comes to when like now utajua duta feel like it doesn't talk about something that is beneficial to both of you eh. ama it doesn't talk when somebody ata kama ana it's a fake love eh. First, that person even doesn't talk about the future. Ama no. what are our plans? Yata kwa tu. Hata kuuliza hata zile missing marks zako. Hata w- <laughs> you They don't even they don't care about yeah. that actually. Hata hata kuuliza. Yeye atakuwa tu eh hiyo nguo imekushika, hiyo nguo iko kwa. Eh. Mtu kama hizo compliments but they don't I want life beyond just is of the bodily thing and what Please yes. our time is fully spent mm-hmm. fully spent so look at this camera here yes. and teach your fellow girls on how just tips in 30 mm-hmm. seconds mm-hmm. on how to identify if a man really loves them in conclusion Hey guys I'm Liz so uh when how to identify if a guy really loves you I think look about the action what that this guy tells you how does this guy act when you guys are around and it will give you a clue on how this guy can treat you if you identify a red flag Don't stay just quit that is the best thing you can do usikuje kushikwa na depression later oh kuna depression kuna later. depression hapa <laughs> mbele <laughs> ameongea kama daktari yes. kwa sababu depression ni madaktari wanatibu mm-hmm. you will tell us next time tukikuita kwa health yes. niambie mtu ana zamlege depression ya kuachwa ya kutupwa ah yes. uh, wewe ongea ki law hapa utuambie utu advice legally <laughs> legal advice here yeah. okay mm-hmm. um hi guys so What I would tell you to do is uh, please remember that love is not just an emotion it's also a choice and uh, remember it's it's not love is not a fight for me I believe that love is not a fight it's something definitely worth fighting for and uh, in order for you to learn what exactly works for you learn to enjoy your single phase um revel in it mm-hmm. understand yourself fully before you can uh, get into your relationship and I uh, value both your platonic and romantic relationships alike uh, but remember that if i may say this in le- in legal terms uh, the duty of care you give to each is def- is different so don't neglect either of those make sure you have a perfect balance in your life and i believe everything will work out for you in terms of love yes thank you i'll do i'll do a research i'll do a research why people kiss with their eyes closed <laughs> i'll do I know be I don't know because whether it's because uh, love is blind but what I can buy <laughs> advice as Kayesu as Sankara is that as you close your eyes to kiss please open your inner eye so that you know whether you are getting into a fake love but then there's everything fake in this world mm-hmm. it's including love mm-hmm. so sikue galebu no when a person really loves you and when is faking it and this is the purpose of this show so that we teach you We teach you singie kwa depression usingie kwa law baadaye mkuenda kuti sijui nini mm. this has been wine the morning my name is Ankara Kayesu and thank you guys for coming mm. so here is to just say bye. salute bye nice hey, uh,